We now go to Texas and the tragic moment of impact between a moving train and a school bus. Take a look at that right there. The bus driver was taking children home at the time. One student was pronounced dead at the scene. Here's ABC's Adrian Banker. Tonight, a community in shock following the death of a middle school student when a train crashed into his school bus. Texas Fire Department is requesting assistance on a train accident involving a bus. On Friday, 70 miles outside of Dallas, police say the bus drove over a portion of track with no way of alerting drivers of an oncoming locomotive. There's no warning lights there. There were only the cross buck signs in place. There were no arms. There were no bells. The impact pushing the bus a quarter of a mile. First responders arrive within three minutes to find the dead 13-year-old boy and an injured 78-year-old driver outside the bus. The only other student on board, a nine-year-old girl, was critically injured and trapped inside. It required a considerable amount of force to extricate her from the area of entrapment. That girl is now in stable condition. As police investigate the cause of the crash, a community mourns. Right now we're all hurting. In a statement just released by police, we are told the driver did stop, but then continued into the path of that westbound Union Pacific train. We're also told that a witness reports hearing the train's horn sound as it approached that intersection. Tom, we're told this bus driver had a clean driving record. Still so many questions there, though. All right, Adrian, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.